E.T. was the first stop for the stars talking about the final saga of the Star Wars franchise. That's right, Rachel. This is the place to be celebrating 40 years of Star Wars at the premiere of The Rise of Skywalker. You suddenly are like, oh my God, it is the last one. Are we okay? Like, I mean, we're, we're fine, are babe. Are we okay? Babe, we are five years going strong, love. Harrison Ford, Mark Hamill, the Property Brothers. Jonathan Scott brought girlfriend Zoe Deschanel. They were all among the galaxy of stars who shut down Hollywood Boulevard last night, just like they did when the first film in this trilogy premiered. We were standing in this very spot four years ago. Look how young I look. I was terrified, I was shaking. As I am now, shivering and sweaty. That really attractive combination. What was going through my head was, I'm so scared, but this is the beginning to something really, really cool. Do you remember what was going through your head in this moment, this N night? No, I was so drunk. I said, I don't know who I'm hugging, but it feels good. Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker brings the intergalactic saga to a close. Watching the movie was bittersweet for Daisy. This is Daisy Ridley. What was the face you made when the credits rolled? And I was like, I don't want to cry in front of you. I just want to get in the car. And then I had to watch some Friends to wind down. <laughs> By the way, this movie, which is the last one in the Skywalker saga, is expected to rake in as much as $200 million on opening week alone. 